Hey guys, kind of super here, and today I got a match of StarCraft 2. Uh, this is my first match online uh, in the practice league on a map called Novice Metopolis, I think that's what it's called. I think that's how you pronounce it. And I'm a big newbie at this game. I really don't know what I'm doing in this game at the start because this is my first match. I did play through the campaign, so I do know some of uh, some of the Terran units and what they do. But that's all about I know in this uh this game. I also play StarCraft One. I was not good at StarCraft One. I was abs I was horrible at StarCraft One. And I'm just going off with what I know from it. So I'm just building a supply depot just to get next units. I'm gonna build a barracks after that. But I'm just gonna speed this up because this is practice league and there's not gonna be that much action at the start. You see these destructible rocks right here prevent you from getting out of your base and from people getting into your base. So I'm just going to speed this up to faster times 8. What I like in StarCraft 2 now with the SCVs, you can actually rally your SCVs to the minerals and have them start mining immediately. Also, I like the addition of the reactor and the uh, tech labs because, you know, it gives an easier way for you to upgrade your units. And uh, for reactors, you can build marines much faster or build hellions or whatever you have here in Starport, like Vikings. Right here, I start destroying the destructible debris because I want to get out of my base and try to get this expansion and try to, try to like, put some pressure on the uh, opponent get some tanks out but nice guy over here having four vikings already he's gonna push out really soon with the vikings and he's gonna pass right over my marines he's gonna probably go back and try to take him out and my I put in some reapers over here to harass his SCV because reapers they can uh they have a jetpack and can jump up and down cliffs, which is really nice if you wanna harass your enemy if they have their choke blocked or if they have their natural blocked off or something. I like the Vikings in this game because they have great anti air and they can get on the ground and just do some ground damage too. Right here I'm building I'm taking my marines and destroying this destructible debris, trying to get in his base. And he has like you no know, a lot of Vikings. <laughs> he has about seven Vikings. And he's gonna go straight in my base, he's gonna destroy that medvac and it's gonna put me in a hard position to defend and get in his base now. Unless I destroy this destructible debris. I do have missile turrets you know kind of scattered around my base but really they're not going to be that much effective against seven vikings and as you can see i have a lot of mineral build up over here i'm not building that much that many things i sh i probably should be building a lot of marines uh for those vikings but you know i didn't really know what i was doing and i didn't know he was uh going to push out he has a uh, like nine vikings so he's gonna push into my base, and I'm gonna be—it's uh, gonna be hard to defend because I don't really have any anti-air units. All I have is one siege tank and another siege tank coming out. These missile turrets aren't really gonna do anything. He's just gonna fly right by them and land. <laughs> so at this point in the game, I'm uh, really freaking out. You know, it's like, what do I do with all these Vikings? So, you know, I just pull all my SCVs over to my my natural because luckily I have one. And my Reapers just get slaughtered by those Vikings. Like, they didn't have it. They didn't stand a chance. I'm just trying to get a whole bunch of siege tanks out right now. I lift my Orbital Command and uh, try to fly it away. You know, these Vikings can, like, easily just lift up and destroy it, which I think they're about to do in just a second here. After they just destroy everything, it's 
Vikings. Vikings, they can just... They, they can immediately lift off and just start attacking your air units, which is really annoying because they have a very strong uh, attack. Try to get uh, missile turrets up right here because take out those Vikings. So the Vikings are just flying around and, uh, you know, causing havoc basically in my base.